She is a powerhouse actress, producer, and entrepreneur. And today she's here to share what she's excited about this holiday season and what she's looking forward to in the new year. So please welcome Lala Anthony. Yeah. Hi, good afternoon. Thank you. Thank you. It's great to see you. We're so happy that you're here. We Thank loved you, you in power. We love you in Black Mafia family. It will return this spring. I want to put up for everyone because we got a special look at your character, Markeisha Taylor, yes. right here. So Ooh. tell us, what are you looking forward to this new season? What can fans expect? This show is just a roller coaster ride. Once you think you have it figured out, it's a twist and a turn and something something else happens. But I love that at the core of BMF, it's such a story about family and love mm -hmm. and loyalty. And it's just an incredible, incredible story. And this season definitely does not disappoint. So shout out to the cast, shout out to 50. It's going to be um, an incredible ride. That's right. incredible. Acting, producing, entrepreneurship. I don't think there's anything that you can't do. Oh, but you. is there a title that you haven't held yet that really excites you? You know, I love all the titles that I hold. My favorite one is Mom. Cayenne's mom. That's my favorite title in the world. And, you know, just continuing to just get better at everything I do, you know, continuing to just find projects that push me and excite me, find things that I like to do in the world that push me and excite me. It's all about growing and getting better and evolving. So I want to continue to do that. And you are so busy. And although right now the holiday season is a chance for us to maybe slow down even for a minute. <laughs> reflect, take stock yes. of the year that's passed and, and what's ahead. Yes. So what do you focus on around the holidays? So for me, the holidays are definitely a time to give back. I mean, myself and my team, we love to give back all the time, but the holidays especially. So we just re recently did a winter wonderland in the Bronx for 400 plus inner city kids where we give them Christmas, we have music, performances, we have dinner together. It's just an incredible, incredible time for the kids to celebrate, you know, Christmas and really get into the spirit of what Christmas and giving back means. So we just had that recently in the Bronx and that was really fun. And then I have a program called 360 out of Rikers Island and we just had our Christmas dinner there for young incarcerated men ages 18 to 21 and that was also extremely powerful and just a great feeling to be in a position to give back to me you know what you do for others is definitely the greatest measure of success for me like that's when I feel the most successful when I'm able to do something for others that's when I feel like I feel good. I feel mm. like this This is what I'm here for. You do so much in the community there in the Bronx, like you just talked mm -hmm. about. Rikers Island with that focus on reentry mm -hmm. for so many. Mm -hmm. What is your New Year's resolution? What are you looking forward to this next year? So, my New Year's resolution is better time management. Ah. <laughs> when you said slow down for the holidays, I'm like, who slows yeah, down who? for the holidays? <laughs> Tell my team over there, we don't slow down for the holidays. So I'm like, better time management. And also, you know, finding some time for myself. I do work really hard and I'm, I'm, I'm a mom and I'm all about, you know, doing so much for everyone. But it's nice to have some time to yourself and, and prioritize yourself. And I think as as a woman, we definitely have to yeah. do that. So I want to get better at that in, in the new year for sure. I love that. What do you do as a mom mm -hmm. with a son who has such a big social media following like you? He's sort of he's coming into his own. Is right. he becomes a man. Mm -hmm. What sort of messages do you have for him as he navigates maybe a public facing life? You know, I just tell him to be be yourself. When, when you're yourself, you can keep that up. When you're trying to be somebody else and when you're trying to fit a mold to what you think people want you to be, you won't be able to keep that up. Be yourself. And either people are going to rock with you or they won't. And the ones that ride for you, you ride for them. And the ones that don't, you don't worry about that. And my son is just genuinely his authentic self. And that's what I love about him. He's comfortable, you know, with who he is. He's confident with who he is. And I admire that about him. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And you're that way, too. And when you're Thank that you. way, you get permission for other people to be that Thank way you. as well. Thank you. we got to give a shout out to the, the what, what was it, your mom I know loves? My mom, oh. my mom loves your hair care products, that, too. Anala, yeah. And that is so amazing. I'm happy to hear that. Yeah. It's working wonders on her hair. i got to get you some. <laughs> I there, love see, it. We're trying to set you up with the free swag. That's what you got to do when you're out here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the more okay, you're talking okay, okay. about it. I like that. I like that. <laughs> the more you get it. Lala, thank you so much. Thank Have a very you. Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. We're so glad that you spent some time thank with us you. in your busy schedule. <laughs> One more round you. of applause. Thank you. Same to you guys. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.